Well, we met about 30 minutes. He, uh, he uh, reached out to, to uh, us and wanted to meet about uh, community policing and community relations, and more importantly, how he can partner with the police department to try to uh, uh, build trust with uh, young people. And it was just a really thoughtful uh, young man and uh, really, really enjoyed uh, meeting with him earlier today. What does it mean to you as the police chief that he, he's only been here a short time, he wanted to reach out and try to make an impact through you? You know, two weeks into, uh, I think it's been like two weeks now, and uh, for him to immediately reach out just shows that uh, this is important to him. The issue of, uh, of uh, policing and uh, community relations is something that's important to him. I think it speaks as to his character, it speaks as to his maturity. And quite frankly, when uh, he, he says to me that he wanted to bring a program here, he was getting ready to roll in, in Miami. And I asked him about Jorge Colina, who's my, who's my friend and police chief in Miami. He said, I didn't quite get it done because I ended up coming here. Uh, but he wants to start a program where they recognize a police officer, uh, officer of the month, uh, an officer that's making a difference, impacting crime, uh, doing it in creative ways and uh, in, uh, by building partnerships, not necessarily by going around making hundreds of arrests and things of that nature. And so uh, I, I, I'm in the people business, and I think what's made me successful over the years is being able to uh, look into somebody and look into their and uh, through them and to them. And I can tell you that uh, I look forward to a partnership with him and, and expanding our partnership with the Texans that uh, work so much with us in community policing.